Welcome to Final Fantasy 15, Episode 1. Uh, I'm playing this game blind. I have 28 minutes in the game, as of now, uh, just to make sure it ran, pretty much. Uh, but yeah, we're going to be starting this today. I've never played a Final Fantasy game on, uh, on YouTube yet, so I figured it would. it's about time I did. Uh, I'm just gonna go new game. I have a. I'm gonna go normal. Um, should I do the tutorial? Sure, let's do it. Uh, yeah, yeah. That's, this is pretty much what I did uh, for the test recording, basically, uh, to make sure it ran. So, so yeah, we're gonna be starting this game blind. I haven't seen anything in it. We're gonna be experiencing it together. I know this guy's name is Noctis, and that's Carbuncle. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Why is it like jittering? Whoa, whoa. Easy does it. Yeah. I'm not gonna read this, it's going too fast, and I'm a slow reader. Uh, it's an old training room. We're gonna teach you how to fight. Okay. That's pretty much pretty much it. <laughs> I'm, I'm playing on mouse and keyboard. Uh, I do have a controller. I haven't tried it with controller yet. I figured I would try it this way first. Uh, let's do the combat tutorial. Gladio says he'll help you train. What a pal. All right, let's get started. Okay, let's do it. I don't know why it's jittering like that, but it's weird. How do you defend? Uh, okay. What, you left click? First, let's practice defending. Oh, no, okay. Phase. Uh, hold the right. You automatically hold the right mouse key uh, to automatically evade attacks. The key is to defend slightly ahead of time. Okay, I can do that. Bring it on. Bring it on. Something like that. Nice work. Oh man, those are some weird mouse controls. Let's practice a little more. One. Two. I might switch to controller just for uh, camera's sake. Alright, now it's your turn to strike. Oh, I guess I can lock onto him. Uh, blitz. Okay, hold the automatically chain attacks. Move with uh, AWSD while attacking to change the way the combo unfolds. Strike a foe from behind to deliver a blindside for 50% more damage. I can do that. Okay, there's the lock on. Okay, bring it on, punk. Yay! Circle behind and whack. That's how you do it. Okay. Um. Parrying. Uh, block and counter. Okay. Certain enemy attacks can be parried. A shield will appear, signaling you to defend. After defending with right click, swiftly press left click to parry. Okay. That's cool. Boom! Okay, easy peasy. Said three times. Have I not done it three times? Oh, okay, there's maracas. <laughs> Noctis will take heavy damage if you fail to perform the initial block. Uh, stay on guard and be ready to defend at all times. An intensive drill is available to help you hone your parrying skill. Oh, that was a cheap shot. Okay, time to put all that into practice. Attack, defend, and parry your way to victory. Okay, bring it on. Yeah. 
Oh, I didn't do it on time. Okay, bring it on. Uh, you see that little cheap shot he tried to do? Come on. Dead. Complete. Well, my time was bad, but everything else was good, so that's good enough for me. Now you've got the hang of the basics. Say, while you're here, want to practice warping too? What's warping? Begin next tutorial? Sure, let's do it. Let's do the tutorial. Let's let's do it. Let's uh, learn stuff. Uh, warping an MP. Ooh. Warping. All right, it's warping time. F is blade warp. Noctis has the ability to instantly warp where he throws his weapon. Okay. Form a blade warp. That's F. Okay. Press F to throw your sword. Oh, cool! Shift to lock on, warp strike. Okay. Uh, Z is track. And then shift is cancel. So lock on, warp strike. Z. Okay. Boy, this is gonna be complicated. Okay. We can do it. We can do it. Camera stays centered on the target. Uh, helping you keep it in your sights. Okay, good. Because that's what I'm worried about is, uh... Now it's time to strike. Lock on to Gladiolus. Lock on. Warp strike. The damage Noctis deals increases with distance. Oh. Nice work. Let's move on. Point warp. In addition to warping or warp striking enemies, Noctis can also point warp to specific locations. Uh, look around and press F to warp, uh, point warp. You can point warp to blue markers when they appear on screen. Okay, cool. So I can actually, what? Point warp to the marker. What marker? Ah! I'm effing. There we go! Find your... Oh, okay. Cool. While suspended from a warp point... Uh, a point warp spot, Noctis will automatically lock onto a target. Okay. And then I can uh, warp strike from here. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Managing MP. Warping and phasing consume MP, which is shown as a blue gauge above Noctis's head. After point warping, as well as the bottom on the bottom right, if Noctis uses MP to into deficit, he enters stasis, which severely limits his abilities. I'm sorry if you guys hear my dog; he's barking at something. Keep an eye on MP and use items to keep it replenished. Uh, cover. Okay. Take cover behind large objects like rocks and pillars to recover both HP and MP. Oh, cool, you can hide me. Okay, so I can actually come over here and uh, do this. No. Why isn't it? Oh, do I have to hold it? I have to hold it, that's why. Okay. There we go. Performing a warp, a point warp instantly restores all MP. Uh, take note of markers in case you need respite. Okay. Noted. Try taking down Gladiolus with warp strikes alone. Review warping throws on the right of the screen. Defend and take cover as necessary. Okay. Uh, why? Oh, I have to, like, face it. Okay. So, yeah, do that. Then I have to actually look, like, directly at it. No, that ain't working. Okay, punk. Oh, jeez, I missed him. Hit the wall. Oh, 
Jeez, he almost got me. No, I don't want to warp strike. I want to go up there. Why? He'll never find me here. Ever. Ever, ever. There we go. Okay, there it is. And... Hiding. Nope. 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 Surprise! Bet you didn't know I was there. Now let's see. Up. No. Oh, like this. No. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> hey, buddy. There you go. Jeez. I'm terrible at this. It says look around and press right click, and, or uh, F, and it like didn't warp. It just warped me past it. Or if I was running back and I was like looking at it, it wouldn't. Yeah. Anyway, enough excuses, Mealy. How about you just uh, do your thing? Resistances! Attack Gladiolus. Okay. I can do that. Try attacking Gladiolus a few times. Okay. Okay, it worked that time, so I guess that's a thing. Okay, it works like that. Weapons! When striking an enemy, the damage value may appear in different colors. Orange indicates increased damage, while purple indicates reduced damage. Uh, enemies can be resistant or weak to different weapons. Swords do not seem to work very well against Gladiolus. So you will want to try another weapon. Okay, two great sword and four is daggers. Okay. Let's try. Oh, I got hurt. Oh. Let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's do this. They'll never see me. They'll never know I'm here. Okay, I didn't think daggers were going to be too cool, but they're pretty cool. Let's try this one. Noctis has obtained a javelin, a type of polearm. Try equipping it now. Uh, tab. Okay, tab to open the main menu. Gear. Uh, equip Noctis and his friends with weapons, accessories, outfits, and techniques. Noctis can equip up to four weapons, while his friends can only equip two. An icon legend can be viewed from the main menu with two. Okay. Uh, let's see. Is it two? No, it's the main menu. Uh, oh yeah, Noctis, and let's do... It's a two-handed sword. That's the uh, one I've got equipped, I think. Let's do... Where is it? Uh, Z and X. That's kind of weird. There we go. Okay, so I think that's number three. I don't know. His clothes are like freaking out. Something's weird. Oh well. It is what it is. Is it three? Yeah, okay.
Okay, cool. Spells! To use magic, you have to equip it like a weapon. That's cool. Uh, here's a spell to get you started. Fire times five. Oh! Let's obtain the spell fire. Uh, tab, main gear. Okay, da, 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 da. okay. I go tab, and then I go gear, and then I go noctis, and I go. Uh, let's get rid of. Gosh, they're all so cool. Let's get rid of the two handed sword, and we will do. Ah, oh, there it is. Fire! And I don't know which uh, slot that is, but. Spell casting! Okay, swap weapons, select fire, and cast stone down by the Okay. Three, four, one, two. There we go, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Pretty cool. Uh, and it don't burn me something. Okay, prime spell. Uh, aim, release, cast. Magic, magic is extremely powerful and destroys indiscriminately. Take care that your allies are not caught in the devastation. Enemies can be resistant or weak to different elements. Gladiolus is currently weak against fire. When a weakness is struck, damage values appear in orange. Noctis cannot warp strike while wielding a spell or machinery. You must first switch to another type of weapon. Okay, okay, okay. Checking resistances. Uh, the game features two combat modes, active and wait. Oh. I don't, I, I like active. I really like active. I didn't know that this would have active and wait. Um, okay, anyway. Uh, active is like, time keeps flowing as you're doing actions. It's like uh, your action RPGs are basically an active. Uh, wait is you get time to pick uh, your spells and stuff, yeah. Emphasize strategic elements of combat. Engage wait mode and lock onto an enemy to analyze it. Okay, so I can switch back and forth. That's cool. Here's some elemental energy you can use to cast something. Ice energy. The same old tricks won't work on Gladio this time. Find out what he's weak to and then let him have it. Okay, so I go. Now how do I? Oh, is it elementy? Craft spells using the elemental energy you have collected, then equip spells. Equip magic flasks to use them in the field. Okay, adjust the amount of energy or add a catalyst when crafting to increase the spell's potency or add an effect such as poison or multicast. Review your history to quickly craft more of the same spells. Okay, so let's see. Uh, magic flasks. I would go here, right? I would go here. And I would go, let's see. Oh, okay. Like that. What? Just the amount of elemental energy. Okay, so if I go like. Oh, okay, I guess this is the only one I have, so... Go well, five. Why not? And then, uh, do I hit enter? No, I go to craft. There we go, blizzard times three. Ice-based elemental damage. Equip to this one, right? Cause he, I mean, let's face it, he's probably weak to blizzard. Okay, cool. Oh, jeez! That's crazy awesome. Okay. Nope. I want to hit you with this again. Charge up. Charge up.
That's awesome. Now how do I check resistances? Uh, let's see. Element C. Tab. Okay, let's take a look. Let's see, I want to go fire. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. Okay, that's interesting combat. I kind of dig it. Um, yeah, you know, I'm not cold or anything. <laughs> should I do the next one? Sure, let's do it. I should do all the tutorials because, let's face it, um, I'm a noob at this game. <laughs> Teamwork. Am I gonna have homies? Oh, it looks like it. You rang? Whoa. Who's this dude? Link strikes. Noctis's friends engage in combat automatically. If they are nearby when Noctis performs a parry or blindside using a sword, greatsword, or pole arm, they may join in for a link strike. Team up against Gladiolus. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Let's see, I want to go to this one. Okay, the combat in this is pretty cool. Noctis' friends have unique techniques they perform at his command. Performing a technique in depletes the tech bar, which fills gradually in battle. Uh, control and aid... Okay, that performs a technique. Sweet. Try having Prompto perform Piercer. Okay. So, we go like this. Oh, that's cool. A successful technique creates an opening for Noctis. Press left click, white and prompted to follow up with another attack. Spend AP in the Ascension menu to learn new techniques. Oh, it's like a sphere grid. Look at it. Uh, and put their myriad effects to use in battle. Okay. Oh, I want to do that. So I didn't go all the way through this uh, tutorial. Oh! Okay. I'm hurt. What do I do? When Noctis runs out of HP, he enters a state of danger. This not only impairs his abilities, it also decreases his maximum HP over time. When he takes damage... Oh, and when he takes damage. When his maximum HP falls to zero, the game is over. Noctis recovers from danger with time, or when a friend comes to his rescue. Okay. But the HP stays there. Okay, got it. Got it, got it. <sighs> Friends also fall into a state of danger when they run out of HP. Unlike Noctis, however, they do not automatically recover and need to be rescued first. Rescue prompto. Right click. Okay. Got it. Recovering from danger does not restore maximum HP. Okay. Combat items. Characters can still use items while in danger. If an item targets only one person, select who. Uh, T is use item, and then, okay. Got it. Use elixirs to restore Noctis and Prompto's maximum HP. So it's, uh, oh, okay, T opens it. 
Restore maximum HP for Noctis Prompto. Okay, uh, let's see. So I'd use a potion, honestly. Got it. Right? Going to your... Oh, okay, does it... Um... Oh, it doesn't, like... Does it recover, or is it... Oh, okay, it doesn't go beyond, so let's see. Store maximum HP, it'd be the elixir, wouldn't it? Okay, that's it. I wonder how rare elixirs okay. are in this, because I might not be doing that. Just say it. Potions and elixirs lift a state of danger while restoring HP. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool. Now, team up with Prompto to take down Gladiolus. Okay, let's do it. Yeah. Oh, I want to use this. Jeez. I guess that's all he's got, so... Oof, I got hurt. I'm in stasis, that's why. Gotta run and hide. How do it? so? Oh, jeez. Trying to warp out of here. How do I do that? Cool. <laughs> I'm terrible at this, but this is fun. With your buddies at your side, you've got nothing to be afraid of. Okay, uh, my friends, I want to thank you all for watching uh, the tutorials. Yeah, because this next part takes a while. So I'm going to uh, leave it here and I will see you guys for a new game. I'm going to call this episode zero. So thank you, thank you, thank you. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.